underground in the Torres Strait generally is called Cap Maori but in the traditional language the full the true Torres Strait language on the eastern Torres Strait is called Amei and in central and western Torres Strait Amai who the cook underground 
and it is only done on special occasion. As you saw when we buried the first one, we, we put mat over. Traditionally, mat go over. And every time you do Kapmari, somebody got to sacrifice mats. And mat take a while to make. So it's not an everyday thing. Today, Kapmari is done more often because you see after this one, they'll put uh, silver paper over. Silver isolation, I think, from the building they use now in Torres Strait. Very common as a substitute for, as a big alpha oil, you might say. So we use that one now, and then Kapmari can be done anytime, but in the past, he only done on special occasion because he need mat to cover. You saw the first one? We traditionally use mat. That was the original way of doing things. Few new items we use there, you, you might have seen, shovel. Before we pick up the stone by the tongs, tongs made from bamboo called komazir, and is buried by clamshell. We didn't have sub all them time. Empty clamshell dragging the sand. They normally done in a soft area where it can be buried. Today we got modern things. We still do our culture, but we, we can go another uh, distance now. So that's the story behind the Kapmari.